yoga class number 133, Zen Yoga, with a moon salute and a flowering mudra. This is your sneak peek into the live stream room at the guest bungalow. Hello and welcome. The offering for this week was an hour as usual and I loved it from start to finish to the extent that it was difficult for me to choose my favorite portion to share with you in the now. We did Zen Yoga, which is a fusion of standing yoga postures, Tai Chi and Qigong. We also did a Moon Salute, which is a beautiful way to conclude the evening before going to bed. It is a practice I try to do on a daily basis to express gratitude to the moon and to also break up the tension in the holding, the pressure from the day, uh, to release and facilitate a uh, nicer rest for my body. But the very last pose before Shavasana I have decided is my favorite and what I'll be sharing with you in the moment. If you'd like to join me on the yoga mat, do so. You will need a yoga strap for this sample or something comparable like a belt from your closet or a scarf. You're going to make your way on to your back. Hug your knees into your chest. And just gently rock side to side, preparing in the body for a, a hold, a deep stretch. You're going to place the strap around the balls of both of your feet and lengthen your legs up into the air, walking your fingertips as close to your toes as comfortable, keeping your arms and legs as straight as possible. And then here we move into my favorite pose in the hour sequence. Allow your legs to fall out to the side, coming into a straddle. You're just looking for that gentle point of resistance within the body and you pause there. Breathing in and out through the nose. If you can reach your fingertips to your toes, you can do so. Otherwise, you just use the support of the straddle. to support the flexibility within the body. Slowly hug your knees into your chest and return to the rock side to side. Whenever we're in a relaxed position, it's best to roll onto your right side, so I apologize that my back is going to be to you for a moment, and then you just curl up into a little ball, feeling deeply supportive, and use your hands to push yourself up, and return to a comfortable seat. If you'd like to join me live streaming weekly from the guest bungalow, we do so on Fridays from 12 to 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And we also meet for a mat chat experience 15 minutes before and after. Gives us an opportunity to be get together as a community and for you to express your desires for the sequence at the start, should you have any. And also let me know how the sequence was for you at the conclusion. Thank you for your time and I do hope to see you at the guest bungalow. Namaste. And don't forget to stretch. Visit theguestbungalow.com today. We're open 24-7. Visit and stay for as long as you'd like.